And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And coming up for you is live action from Major League Soccer. It's the San Jose Earthquakes, and they take on Toronto FC. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Christian This is how it looks for the home side. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Thank you for attending. Have a great time at today's match. And so the battle commences. Carlos Grueso. Now can they make something happen? Ibo Bissi. Now that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. But he's gone short with it. Cutting infield here. Could be. And a goal to open the scoring. A very bright start to this one. Well, here it is again. And it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. Ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Promising move. Bernadeschi. Making sure nothing came of it. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Ayo Akinola. Can he find the right pass? Bernadeschi. Well, the danger is still there. And I think the threat has been averted. Gives it a go. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the problem not completely solved. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This might be ideal for the counter. Surely! Oh, 
a smart stop. And the danger cleared. Will he play it in? Giving it a try. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, I have to say, these fans are making so much noise. This must be inspiring for the players. Short corner favoured. Can he take this chance? And able to close down the shot. And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them to add to their lead. Keen to take it short here. Attending to his defensive chores. Superbly read and executed. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Keeping it on the ground, slightly off target, however. Well, the hosts have completely bossed the game in the last 15 minutes, creating lots of chances now, and you think if they do get another, it's going to be tough for the opposition to find a way back into this. Yes, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Good tackle. Monteiro. Couldn't keep it. You will. Miguel Trauco. Carlos Grueso, fine sequence of passes. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. So back underway here into the second half. And he has options available. Shot attempted. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Monteiro. Espinosa. Ibo Bissi. Good looking sequence. Ewell. Keeping it moving dynamically. Ibo Bissi. Determined defending. Raul Petretta. Insigne. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Good movement. 
and space to cross it over the touchline for a throw in so making the substitution now high quality defending Lorenzo Insigne Cade Cowell Ibo Bissi could be threatening being egged on by the crowd and it wasn't a great pass was it Monteiro into the advanced position but nothing comes of it racing forward trying to catch them out well, so many possibilities but it didn't happen for them Jim timely Jim intervention Well, not cleared away completely. Monteiro. And he takes on the shot. No way through. Jesus Jimenez. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Just ten minutes remaining here. No advantage with them. Referee says play on. Tremendous ball played through. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. the delivery and he clears the danger physically strong and secure on the ball this could be it and it is he's done it surely a case of game over well let's take another look and it's a very good goal and they deserve it you have to say they've been excellent And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Number 35, Yamiro Montiero. Lorenzo Insigne. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Good work to regain possession. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Capo. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created just well. It was a great performance. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round.